Si mga lasinggera dyan, guys. This is for you. So... <laughs> Hi, this is Jenny and welcome back to our channel guys And for today's video, as you can see on the title Today, may bag na naman tayong product na every review at ita try. You might be wondering Jenny, parang may bago ata sa setup mo ngayon <laughs> Para sa mga nakafollow sa aking mga social media account Which is my Instagram and Facebook Therefore, you know na nag-open ako ng aking business guys It's all about the room decoration stuff Lamps, neon lights and all to hashtag revamp your space Says, yeah, if you want to purchase it, I will be linking it down below my shop. Actually, to be honest, na miss kong mag film because last week super, super may sakit ako. Like, it's been 2 weeks ata or 3 weeks na na hindi talaga ako nakashoot ng literal na new vlogs. Pero, right now, I'm okay na naman. I'm back in filming again. So, ayun. Um, but without further ado, let's hop on to the main focus of this video. Today, guys, as you can see, ang product na i-review natin ngayon ay ang Focalior. I have here the two shades of this product and this is called the Focalior Hangover Red Wine Blusher. So, totoo lang, napakaganda ng packaging talaga nitong Focalior. It's really chic. Mukha siyang mamahalin. Mukha siyang, alam mo yun, high-end product. At gustong 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 gusto kong sabihin sa inyo na this is only 129 pesos. Yes, you heard it right. It's 129 pesos each sa gantong uri ng packaging and ang laki niya guys. Cool ng name niya no? Hangover Red Wine Blusher. The whole marketing of this one is really something na I think connected into someone who loves drinking. The net weight of this one is 5 grams and it says here that it is a cruelty free product. So, alright. What I have here is in the shade of tequila which is... I love. If papa inumin mo ko, please tequila na lang. And also, I have here the shades of Bordeaux. The other two shades is Sherry and Pink Lady. Color is created and made from China. And on its product carton, guys, it's really good din kasi may kita nyo agad yung ingredients niya. Tapos meron pa dito, uh, para siyang isi-scratch mo siya para malaman mo if you receive is really a legit focal your product. At meron din agad expiration date na may kita nyo sa kanyang packaging. It says here it would expire in 2023, 3 years from now, which is cool because usually products expires for 1 to 2 years. Kapag binuksan nyo na siya guys, ito ang itsura niya and like what I said, this is in the shade number 3, Bordeaux and as you can see, no, kitang kita naman dito na super laki ng product na to. Sobrang dami nun sa, sa price point niya. Kaya I'm really hoping talaga na maganda rin ang kaniyang uh, and that's <laughs> happy vlogging <laughs> yes yeah, self kaya mo to kaya mo to kaya mo to okay. Okay. so bubuksan ko na rin yung tequila dun sa 4 shades na nakita ko sa kanilang website yun talaga yung minata ko agad I am really really excited about the shade this tequila ones this two looks really promising and medyo parang magkapareha sila sa camera no pero in person si um oh wait si tequila is much more deep rather than the border but let's watch it now and as you can see no i have a minimal makeup para ma try on talaga natin sila for the first time this is now the shade that i have here on my hands katulad ng sinabi ko guys ayun sa tequila mas deeper talaga yung pagka pink niya and uh, ito yung si Bordox once na swatch ko na siya parang may pagka peach tone pala siya to be honest kapag titingnan ko siya dito no parang ano yung kulay niya na medyo lutang may pagka neonish lalo na yung si Bordox i'm afraid that kapag ganun siya hindi to gaano ko compliment sa mga much more darker skin tones ang cool niya eh ko kung makikita siya sa camera Oh, I don't think it reflects on the camera. Pero in person, guys, meron siyang mga glitters. Kaya kumikinang siya. Ay! Interesting finds. But, anong amoy nito? Wait nga. Okay, ah. Kaamoy nito yung if you watched my Sessy View review 
uh, gano'n yung amoy niya. Para siyang candy na matamis na bilog na grapes na hindi ko talaga mapangalanan kasi hindi na siya mahanap ng memory ko. And yung kanyang ano, no, applicator, it's really huge. Pero I don't mind actually. Katulad siya ng applicator ng BLK Moose Creams that would emulate our fingers. So now, let's put it on our face. Let's see how it will perform. On this side, I will do it with my bare hands. On And to the side, I will use a brush para makita natin yung blending capacity niya as it is. So dito, ilalagay ko na siya. Oh, sana lang hindi pala agad marami, no? Kasi baka mamaya, super pigmented pala niya. And, oh, it's easy to blend. Oh, ang bilis mo blend! Nice! I think this is, this one is the quickest blending time na na-try ko. Isa pa, lalagyan ko pa ulit, ha? Oh, this is two layer, guys. Pero sobrang boom na nung color niya. You didn't have to, alam mo yun, hindi mo siya kailangan ulit-ulitin para makita mo talaga yung kulay. Yeah. Um, hindi siya creamy. Ito, wala siyang iniiwan na velvety feeling, pero maan siya, madulas. And which is actually, I prefer much rather than the velvety feeling one. Yeah, oo. Kasi parang ito, wala kang nilagay talaga sa cheeks mo. As in, you feel nothing. And nagsaset siya as kind of like a powder. Hindi rin siya greasy sa pakiramdam. It seems like, yun nga, parang wala kang nilagay sa mukha mo. Ang cool nito ah. Ang gagawin ko ngayon, gagamitin ko naman itong brush para ilagay dito sa kabilang part ng ating face. This is a synthetic brush guys. Mm-hmm. Medyo may struggle ng ate. You need to like parang fully, fully, fully blend it. That's why actually sa mga gantong product talaga, it's best to use your fingers because may, may warmth kasi yung hands natin. Kaya it also increases the speeds of how the product melts to our skin. But still, look, it diffuses beautifully on my skin with a brush. It's just that you need much more effort to do it rather than with your finger. And look at that color. Tingnan ko nga kung lumalabas sa skin yung mga glitters niya. Hmm. Hindi siya ganun ka-noticeable. I mean, may kita niyo siya kapag hinanap niyo siya. Pero hindi siya yung tipong may kita niyo siya kahit hindi niyo siya gustong makita. So, ang gagawin ko na is ilalagay ko naman si Burdox dito sa ating eyes. And I think I'm just going to use my fingers with this one. Oh! Wait! As I'm really smelling it now, I realize that it smells like a wine. Yeah, it really smells like a wine. Bigla siyang parang ting! Hmm, cool! So, ayun, it smells like a wine pala. Para naka-indulge siya, para uminom ka, parang ganun. So, sa mga lasinggera dyan, guys, this is for you. So, <laughs> ayokong damihan kasi baka mag-over-eme. Hmm. Dali talaga nito ma-blend. Walang kahirap-hirap. Here go! The formula of this one, super nipis niya. I mean, it gives you a subtle pigment. Which is a good thing and a bad thing. Since ka kapag newly ka lang si makeup, syempre kahit medyo damihan mo siya, hindi ka magugulat at hindi ka gugulatin ng pigment. Yung cost lang niya is it's, it's a product consuming. Kasi if you want to really see the pigment of this one, you need to pile on and pile on. But it's there. It's not giving you nothing. If you want to find the shade the much more universal, go for tequila one. Ay, ay lalagay ko pala siya sa lips ko. So, ay nakalimutan ko lagyan yung labi ko. I think nakikita nyo na yung tinutukoy ko na itong si Burdox may pagganiyo na siya. Ooh, now you can see. May kita mo yung glitters na sinasabi ko once nilagay nyo siya sa labi nyo, guys. Ang tricky niya tingnan kasi could work. Pero for me, it's kind of distracting. I don't know, siguro preference yun na to. Kung gusto nyo na ganito yung itsura niyan. To be honest, hindi naging masaya yung experience ng paglalagay nito sa labi. Tingnan nga natin kung anong claims nila dito. Silky Weightless Liquid Blush. Which is true. It says here it has a natural blush, a second skin finishes, and it blends perfectly on the skin, creating MCBB. My chick butt better. 
now I understand. Okay, now I understand why. Because it really is uncomfortable on to my lips. Yeah, it feels so dry. It feels like crap. I'm going to put it out na ha. Kasi, to be honest, it doesn't really feel good. That is one thing that we always need to know, guys. If our product is really a multi-purposed one. Para malaman talaga natin kung para saan lang siya. Hindi natin siya ma-misuse. It says here that it is long-lasting. I agree. Nagkikling on talaga siya sa skin eh. Meron kasing mga cream blush na parang nagsislip out lang siya sa skin mo na naa-absorb siya thoroughly. Pero this one, it clings onto the skin. It, it kind of feels like it masks the skin. Parang siyang occlusive moisturizer. It actually works as a barrier. Parang yung skin mo, tapos yung blush. Nag-tap on siya doon, tapos naging barrier siya ng color. It says here that it is super duper pigmented. It's real. One to two layer and you're good to go. No, tinignan ko yung ingredients nito. Ang lumulutang talaga ng ingredients ay Dimeticon. Dimeticon, guys, is a man-made ingredients or a man made substance. Ibig sabihin, it, hindi ito natural sa ating surroundings. And, katulad doon sinabi ko kanina, diba, it feels like it creates a barrier. Dahil siya doon, dahil siya sa Dimeticon, it also serves as an emollient because it fills into the spaces or into the cracks of your skin like how the emollient moisturizer is. But, the thing is, it is not moisturizing. Okay? It calms the irritation on your skin. And, most of all, the Dimeticon is safe, guys. All in all, guys, in terms of the pricing, the packaging, I don't have anything to say na con sa kanya. Hey guys, nakalibot ako pa lang sabihin na matagal lang talaga yung delivery niya. I think yun lang yung cons na masasabi ko sa kanya. So, yeah. If you're looking for a very affordable blush that could last for you for 3 years that lives up to the expectations, this is a product that is worth to buy. And yeah, there you go na. I think this would be now the end of this video. And I hope nakatulong ako sa inyo sa pag-decide if you want to buy this color blush. And thank you for watching guys. Comment down below any reactions or comments that you have for this video. Don't forget to please give it a thumbs up and also share this to your friends. Don't forget to please subscribe to my channel para notified kayo kapag may new video style like this one. And also you can follow me on my social media account. Thank you for watching again guys. And this has been Jenny. Bye!